Welcome everybody to the kitchen where I'm working on some delicious chicken wraps with a sun-dried tomato hummus. So easy to put together too. So to start this, I have some uh, chickpeas that I, I actually canned them, but you can buy them canned, drain and rinse them off in there. And I've added them into the bowl of my food processor with a couple of cloves of peeled garlic. Now also I have sun-dried tomatoes here. Whenever I see tomatoes on sale, I'll get them, cut them in half, throw them into my uh, dehydrator, and dry them. And then I put them in my pantry so that I can use them. And then just to use them again, all you're gonna do, rehydrate them, soak them in some hot water until they're soft, and then add them to whatever it is you're going to use them in. And they make the most flavorful dishes. I love sun-dried tomatoes, and they're so easy to put together. Yes, I am a bit big advocate for doing food preservations um, because I enjoy not only satisfaction of it, but the food security of it. So I hope all of you are. This is tahini sauce, and I'm going to add that into there about oh, a quarter, a third of a cup or so. And you can buy this at the grocery store. I bought this at Smith's a while ago. And once we get that into there, I'm going to add in some salt and pepper to taste and also a little bit of olive oil and some lemon juice. That is going to be good. Now this is going to be used as the spread for the, the wraps, like you would a mayonnaise or something like that. And so it's a very simple way and a healthy way to add even more protein and flavor to your dishes. So once you get that in there, you're gonna just turn that on and let the food processor puree that until it's nice and smooth, guys. When we come back, we'll finish them up and I'll show you how to put them together. Okay, nice. Well, we are not gonna do remote dining today. We're just gonna Well, the, the watch beauty over. is, you're all welcome to my recipes yeah, you without share every charge. Day. Please yeah. go get them. Make delicious food, guys. Mm -hmm. All right, let's finish up these chicken wraps. They are so fun. I have my corn to or my flour tortilla. Here's the hummus. See how beautiful that turned out? I'll let you get a shot of that before I go dig into it and move it. I we go. Oh, you're getting a shot now. Whoa, that was a close-up quickie. There we go. Beautiful hummus. So easy to make as well. And now what I'm going to do is just kind of take that. And this is going to, like I said, it's going to be the mayonnaise, essentially, that we're going to add on to that. So I like to say, smear it on. That's kind of what the bagel talk is, you know, smear on that cream cheese. But I'm going to smear or spread on that hummus. And also, I have, I'm using my bottled chicken that I do. But you can do a grilled chicken. You can do a canned chicken if you have some on your shelf. You can do any type of meat that you so choose. It's just so simple. Add on some tomatoes to it. And then I have some delicious avocado here. And so I'm gonna just kinda slice that up and add on those avocado slices. It'll have some of the hummus, which is perfectly fine. Put that on there. Delicious, a little bit of salt and pepper. I'm using a seasoned salt that has the, the salt and pepper. Oh, that's a little cumin, which is fine. A little bit of salt and pepper on there that'll have the flavorings in there. And then you're gonna fold this up just like you would a burrito. You're gonna roll it up and voila, you're going to have a delicious chicken wrap that is so delicious and flavorful. Now I'm serving this with a green salad on the side, as well as a slice of ripe papaya. I love it. Head on over to KUTV.com or cookingwithchefbrian.com for the recipe and enjoy some delicious chicken wraps tonight. Yeah, so that's really a burrito. <laughs> Oh, Ron. Oh, We've Ron. been through this. We've been through this. <laughs> I'm just shaking my head. Just shake your head.